How did you find out about the passing of Jim Morrison? The phone rang at 4 o'clock in the morning, and it was Clive Selwood. So I started calling the apartment, no answer. Finally got Pam. I said, I want to help you. I am there for you and for Jim. And I went straight to the airport and got in a plane and flew to Paris. I loved Jim. He was my friend and someone I admired beyond possibility. Pam said that Jim had told her they'd been to visit Père Lachaise because many of the great figures in French culture were buried there. The greatest creatives. We figured out how to make that happen. But he died in a rock and roll circus kind of way in the sense that it fit into the drug abuser box. He may have died that way. There's the doctor that attended said he died of a heart attack. Jim was not a druggie. Saying drink was his uh, it, That was what was going to kill him choice, if yeah. he had enough time. But he also did everything to extreme. If he did do a drug that was deadly, he might have done it to extremes. I always just kind of went with the doctor said he died of a heart attack. None of us thought he'd make 30 because he lived such an extreme.